guys welcome back to my channel it's agazim here if you are new to my channel my name is chagazim izubi i'm a natural hair content creator and entrepreneur at agazim naturals and now a youtuber i live in abuja nigeria my channel is all about natural hair and lifestyle content welcome in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i moisturize my hair in cornrows Cornrows is one of my favorite protective style apart from braids and wigs. It's like a two-in-one kind of protective style for me. While your hair is in a protective style, it still needs all the TLCs. Don't say, I don't need to wash my hair again. Oh, to the next one month. Don't say that. Don't neglect your hair while it's in a protective style. Your hair still needs to be moisturized. Your ends still need to be sealed and you still need to protect your hair at night with a satin bonnet before sleeping. Drop snipe. So before I get down to this tutorial, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the benefits of moisturizing your hair. Number one benefit of moisturizing your hair is that it prevents breakage and dryness. Number two benefit of moisturizing your hair is that it reduces shedding. Number three benefit of moisturizing your hair is that it reduces itchiness. Number four and the final benefit of moisturizing your hair is that it prevents dandruff. Give your scalp all the TLCs guys, not just your hair. Before I get down to this tutorial, I would like you guys to do one thing and one thing only for me. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, please, I would love you to do that now in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Thank you. So guys, because I have low porosity hair, I moisturize my hair using the LCO method of moisturizing. L stands for liquid. My liquid is usually water or tea that I prepped with a bunch of Ayurvedic herbs. The C stands for cream. My cream is usually a very moisturizing leave-in conditioner, which is on Jackie's Quench leave-in conditioner. So the last one is the O. O stands for oil. My own O is my DIY Ayurvedic whipped hair butter and Ayurvedic hair oil. So guys, in this video, my L is going to be tea. I'm going to be making this tea with three to four Ayurvedic herbs. So let's get down to the tutorial. So I'll be preparing the tea with this mug. So the first herb I'll be adding is chamomile. Chamomile contains anti-inflammatory compounds, which alleviate itchy dry scalp. The next herb is rosemary. Rosemary has antibacterial quality. It gently cleanses the scalp and it also stimulates scalp circulation. The next one is lavender. Lavender promotes hair growth and it's also antimicrobial. The next one is ginger. Ginger stimulates the hair follicles which in turn promotes hair growth. It also strengthens the hair strands. This is the leftover from the last batch of tea that I made so I'll be adding it to this one. The next thing I'll be adding is hot water. So I'm going to cover it up with this plate and allow it to brew for 3 hours. So guys, I'm already done prepping my tea. So I allowed it to brew for 3 hours. I've already sieved it off camera. So I'm going to be showing you guys the quantity of tea I got after sieving it. So this is the quantity I got. I got like 2 spray bottles and this small one in my measuring cup. I'm going to be starting with this smaller spray bottle. I'm going to refrigerate the rest. So this tea is going to be my L in a very long time. I'm all about scalp health. So I'm going to be adding a few drops of peppermint and tea tree essential oils into this tea. Essential oil stimulates scalp circulation thereby increasing hair growth. Tea tree totally prevents dandruff. This is going to be my C. I totally love this living condition. It's very, very hydrating. My O is going to be this. My DIY Ayurvedi whipped butter. I totally love this butter. It seals my moisture so, so well. And also, I'm going to be oiling my scalp with my best scalp oil. I totally love this oil. It's from my brand. I'm also going to be dropping the link in my description box. with this tea. I don't like tea dripping down my body and all of that. So for 
the final step, I'm going to be sealing my ends with this DIY Ayurvedic whipped hair butter. I moisturize my hair. I do this every four to five days. So if you enjoyed this video, please do give me a thumbs up, like, share, and don't forget to subscribe. And make sure you click the bell notification button close to the subscribe button so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Between I'm trying to round this video or before Nepa takes flight. I live in Nigeria. I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Do have a lovely day, night, whatever the time is where you are. Take care of yourself. Bye.